projecting possibilities states that art restores our souls, eases our worry, grief, and isolation. How does your artwork reflect this statement? I, I truly believe in the healing capacity of art and the power it has to connect people. And um, I think it does that through sharing perspective and through letting you into how someone else is thinking. And if you allow yourself as a viewer to enter how it might feel to see the world through someone else's eyes, it can be such an enlightening and beautiful experience. So I think that projecting possibilities through, through the vision of projecting possibilities and mission um, as a project, you're allowing people to connect with different viewpoints, different perspectives, different ways of seeing. And I think that's invaluable. How do you think projecting your artwork adds to its meaning for you and the viewer? And have you considered displaying your work this way in the future? So displaying my artwork through projection has been a total dream come true because I create a lot of smaller, more detailed works, but the energy behind them is supposed to be big and bodily and kind of like all encompassing. So I've never shown um, through projection or through large scale work. And so when I saw my work up um, the first night that it was up, I was I was totally blown away because I felt like it was really um, landing in the way that I wanted it to and like able to affect more because of its size, which was so cool. And honestly, I can't see returning to any other way of working because it was so awesome. Yeah, the big, the large scale and the projection was such a great way to deliver my message through my work. Are we able to see your thoughts in your art pieces? given that we all have different experiences leading up to the point in which we see a piece of artwork, totally different life experiences, every one of us, we're going to see things inevitably differently. But I think there is a core essence to something, just as there's a kind of a core essence to people and how, yes, we change and evolve, but there's something about us that stays the same and, sta and makes us unique in our own way. I think it's the same with artwork. And, and that is what I think people see um, when, they, when they view my artwork, but anyone's artwork. Uh, what inspired you to become an artist? I've always been very curious and very observant. And I think that I was, as a child and as an adolescent, I was very hard for people to understand <laughs> because of these qualities. Um, and I think it was kind of the only direction that people could advise me to go in. Everyone just said, be an artist. You can like really express yourself in this way. And and show the world what you're thinking more. And so I think that it was something that intrigued me and something that I was inclined to follow. Um, and from there, I developed my own appreciation for what it is and, and what it can be um, and just creativity in general and, and how, um, how art can be such a beautiful method of transmission of yeah of kind of what we were talking about before thoughts and feelings and perspective well on be thank you so much on behalf of yeah. kids Scoop media um it was really great interviewing you and getting to know your work and you and uh, thank thanks you. guys thank you.